everyone, my name is Eddie Toffey. I'm Head of Technical Analysis and Senior Markets Analyst at ADM Investor Services International Limited. Here is your daily technical analysis of energy futures. I'll start with Ice Brent crude oil futures. A seventh bearish black crow on Friday and a significant move further down and away from the baseline of the recent descending triangle, currently at 67.68. I still have doubts about this descending triangle, but I will go with the flow on this one as long as that is what it is. Below we have the rising long moving average currently 63.88 and then target X, the initial target for the descending triangle in the 62.45 area. We have a secondary target below, that is target X1 in the 57.45 area though that is below some considerable congestion of 59.72 to 60.64 area. Now, so far today a really interesting move, a lower open, not quite a gapping move lower but close then a test further down towards the long moving average but then a sudden attack of cold feet about testing the long moving average and a reverting move back up over Friday's high and up now towards testing the baseline though not quite managing it as yet. Whatever happens it will be the close that matters now today because if we close either above 66.45 or under 65.17 then we'd have a daily key reversal for today anything in between and would have a lesser outside day. Ice gas oil futures. A bit of indecision creeping in on Friday with an indecisive doji cross. Some of the bulls out there would or bears even would I'm sure not like seeing but it was nevertheless the lowest low since May and it was the closest we've been to reaching target X in the 534 and a quarter area the initial target for the recent July to August sideways triangle. Now further below we also have the secondary target X1 for this pattern in the 492 even area though this is below some considerable support notably the long moving average currently up 516 and a quarter. Now so far today much like Brent. A lower open but then a strong move higher not making it to a key reversal but very much a possible bullish engulfing pattern which isn't that hard to do after the previous session was an indecisive doji cross However, the market has risen up to just short of the lower upper, lower uptrend line. Uh, that's actually a three pointer of the recent sideways triangle where we've halted for now. Thank you, list, thank you for listening. This short version broadcast gives essential market patterns and consequences. Please be aware of the risk disclaimer posted with this broadcast. Copyright is Eddie Topic and ADM Investor Services International Limited. And here comes the final bit. <laughs> 